hello everyone so this is the problem that we are going to solve today so when I press G and hold you we get this projectile prediction path and so this will help player to aim the grenade and at the moment it works but the problem is here if it works correctly it should uh, hit the bottom of the wall but if I just release it as you can see it's not going that far it falls short so that's the problem we are going to address today by the way we originally worked on this throw-in mechanisms back in 2022 in March so if you haven't watched those videos you feel free to watch them they are available in my channel uh, actually not just uh, grenades we have implemented flashbangs and small grenades as and just throwing rocks as well so by pressing e we can switch to here let me switch to a, a small grenade oh no that's a flashbang so if i keep looking at it this is what happens and similarly uh, if i switch to a small grenade Here, this is the small grenade icon. If I throw one, this is what happens. So this will block enemies with your uh, vision. Okay, so enough about that. Let's get into today's tutorial. And before that, I'd like to remember that you can download the full project in my Patreon page. Not just this one. I have worked on over 1600 tutorials to the day and for all of those day tutorials you can download the projects all the systems that i have implemented for the membership of my patron club right so back to the issue at hand so if i want to clearly visualize what happens here let me visualize the path that can grenade flies through in space so for that we use this project on moments we just activate it here now activate it yeah activate it here so that this projectile this grenade will go in a projectile moment so here if it is active let's check if it is active let's simply draw a debug sphere in the actor location so we should be able to see the path where the grenade is going through mm, duration i'll give like 100 seconds so we can easily notice that radius i'll keep like 20 maybe 10 okay now if i throw the grenade now you can see the path now let me pause and eject from the character now you can see here this is not a perfect projectile so this simulates something with the uh, with the heavy air drag so when we have a heavy, heavy air drag that's how why it has this curve rather than having a uh, symmetric projectile if there is no drag then this half and the next half should be symmetric so ideally it should have a curve like this but in this case that's not happening the reason is here in the root i have given this linear damping and angular damping too now there is a reason i said that but for now let me just reset it so we still need some damping otherwise it will go on forever i think so now if i do this it will go to the exact position see now now see it's a it's symmetric but the problem here is this so if i let's say if i want to 
throw the grenade in a location like this but if i do that you see grenade keep going see still going that should not happen and that's why i had to set it to a higher value but we can't keep that way because it interferes with our aiming mechanism so what we can do is initially i'll keep this and we have this on component hit event so this is where we play this hit sound which is this one this sound so at this point if i just get the rule set damping linear damping to let's say two and also angular damping to two now let's see it still goes somewhat uh, far but not as bad as before and we can still throw accurately okay uh, let me try again with the closer spot right so what if i increase this value and also we have this projectile bounce bounciness friction if i make it eight and reduce bounciness 0.2 should give us better results let's see yeah that's fit still it moves a little bit but that's realistic so okay now let me remove that this uh, debug spear and now we can accurately throw which is exactly what we needed but they are shooting at me because they hear the shooting uh, explosion sound and they detect me all right so that's all for today thanks for watching see you in another episode goodbye